Hello guys, my name is Ash Moran, and yes, this is more 49ers news, and um, before I start the 49ers news, by the thumbnail, um, congratulations to the 49ers, did really, really well, uh, struggled by the first, second quarter, but third and fourth, especially fourth, we came back, so well done to the 49ers. Now, um, as you can see, I'm outside at work, before I start work, I had to get this news out quick. Um, so, Jimmy G trade, apparently... Um, there's a deadline by Tuesday, so today's Monday, and the deadline's Tuesday for a Jimmy G trade, if it goes off. Um, me personally, there's a lot of rumours saying it might happen, there's a lot saying it won't happen, it will happen. My thoughts and reaction on it, I don't think they'll get rid of him. They won't trade him, I can't see it. For, and there's a, lot, there's, a, there's a lot of reasons, and I'll explain why. Um, but leave your comments and tell me tell me if I think I'm right or wrong because I like to hear your comments as well, guys. So I don't think they will. Number of reasons. Number one, he's good but not great. Now a lot of people can say to me, you know, like last night I saw so much Facebook hate and Instagram hate and Twitter hate and website hate. You know, oh, you know he's he's not running the ball enough. He's not throwing enough. He's not accuracy enough is just not good enough in just just in general you can't say that now where he's done he ran two touchdowns himself okay he did a few brilliant fr like throws nothing made like once or twice nothing major but he did it not only that if you got rid of him right let's say he did go Tuesday and he's gone he's out do you think Trey Lance is going to cope on his own in this season and and Nick Studfield is your QB2 um, Studfield's alright but nothing major Trey Lance is alright but not good or great yet but he will be that's why you need Jimmy G to fill in yes a lot of people might disagree with me might agree with me but that's just my fault Jimmy G goes who's gonna you know you know, Trey Lance will step in, but what, he, what against the Cardinals? We're going against the Cardinals again, and we lost. So do, do you really want to lose to him again? You know what I mean? The way that we played with Jimmy G was really good. Yes, okay, you can argue Q1, Q2 was crap. Q3, we sort of come back into it. The offensive and defense was sort of going into it. And Q4, I thought we did, I thought we did very well. Not great, but very well. So that's one of my reasons. I think it's because of Trey Lance. He won't go. And he'll just fill in until he does go. Two. Reason why he won't go. Why should he go now? When well, you've got one more year with the guy. Next season, I think we'll have him still. You know, I think he'll f fill in the contract. I'll be shocked if he does go. Because, you know, Cole likes him. And I just, and I just think he'll just fulfill the contract that he's got. The five-year contract. And that's it, done. I can't see a trade-off. I really can't. Jimmy G's got that. I think he's got a. I think he's got a personal relationship, like like a personal like friendship with the guy. We're really. You should be just colleagues. That's it, man. It's literally, it's a business. The 49ers need to win. On a business. Um, you know, if you do rubbish, you've got to, you know. The last two years, you know, last year, he weren't there. He should have gone then. Um, this year, he was saved, I think, by the Bears. If he weren't, and he lost in his hometown, yeah, I reckon he might have gone. I think he's got such a good relationship with the team, and I think they can trust him to do a job. Like, even, I think they'll put their heads down hard for the Cardinals. They'll struggle. I don't know if they'll win. I hope they win. But it's like, with Jimmy, can he do the job? He did the job for you in, in Chicago. Can he do the job for you against the Cardinals? That's one of my... Uh, oh, I don't mean to sit there down. Uh, yeah, that's one of my uh, reasons. Um, you know, why would you... My third, yeah, so that's like one of the reasons. I don't think we'll go until next year. He will fulfill the contract, and then he will go, and then Trey Lance will step in. You know, 
three, you could argue with this one, because a lot of people were saying, you know, he was good there because of his family was there. You know, I mean, maybe that's part, part of the excuse, maybe next, you know, Cardinals, he won't do as good. I'm hoping he'll do good. You know, the third opinion on it, I think he can do better, and I think Shanahan said, I think Shanahan, you know, in, in that post interview, said he, you know, he's doing better and better. I, I just don't think in total we'll just get rid of him. That's my thoughts on it. I think we'll keep him until the end. And no disrespect, if you put Trey Lance in there now, I, I think it'll get better, but not great. I think it'll do good, but not very good or not great, or very great, he'll, he'll just be good, like Jimmy G. So what's the point of getting rid of Jimmy G now, then next year, he'll do the same thing, Lance will slowly watch, and then, um, yeah, Trey Lance will take over. Um, but yeah, that's my thoughts on it. I don't think they'll do a trade deal, um, but I'll keep you posted and updated uh, tomorrow and Wednesday as well. If there's any 49ers news as well. But yeah, that's it on it, guys. Leave a comment, tell me what you think. If you think I'm right or wrong, or leave your opinions. I'd like to see your opinions. And um, yeah, uh, thank you very much for the 50 subscribers as well. Very fortunate, humble, appreciate you guys subscribing. If you're new, subscribe. I'll be doing 49ers news. Check my Twitch account uh, on my YouTube channel. If you go to uh, about my Twitch account, um, I do a lot of gaming and stuff like that. And then reviews, reactions on my YouTube channel as well. So, uh, but yeah. Thank you very much for watching guys and I'll see you guys uh, on the next video.